and it's very hopeful for our meeting, that by the will and the decision of the Austrian people, 15 years ago, Austria installed a law which forbids the industrial use of nuclear energy and the military use, of course. Печальном опыте ликвидации одной из самых страшных катастроф, которая постигла нас, я имею в виду 86-й год, Чернобыль. As human beings, we're playing with a very, very, very dangerous toy. No, los Incas conocieron el uranio con otro nombre. El nombre este de uranio, no sé de qué procedencia viene, no sé qué etimología tiene, pero en Quechua a esta roca se conoce con el nombre de Ayacachi, que significa la sal de la muerte o la sal que mata. Es sind, nachdem diese großen Uranlagerstätten gefunden wurden, Menschen zu Hunderten von der Straße weggefangen worden. Es sind Kriegsgefangene dort im Uranabbau eingesetzt worden, zwangsverpflichtet worden. Die beiden Menschen sind nicht nur gegen ihre allmächtigen Nachbarn zu regieren, um ihre nationale Independenz zu erreichen, but Tibet is unfortunately endowed with rich uranium deposits. And I have been exposed to low-level radiation for almost 30 years. I worry that we too may be at risk. I worry that there are many miscarriages in my community and mothers and children are at risk. My father mined uranium for almost 30 years, and I know eventually he will likely die from lung cancer. I attend an old man dying not long ago. The last word he was saying is that my people opened the tent flap. I want to see my land for the last time. That was his last word. That's how much the Indian people love their land, and they're very concerned about it. It's it makes them very sad when the earth is damaged. Vem e vamos em frente. Que esperar não é saber. Quem sabe faz a hora. Não espera acontecer. Obrigado. Technology has made many things possible today. And it has also made it possible that the victims of technology cannot testify or prove technology accountable for its destruction. Die radioaktive Strahlung hat uns von allen vier Himmelsrichtungen umschlossen. Der Nordwestwind, der zum Dreiviertel des Tages und der Nacht auf uns zuweht, verbindet uns mit Semipalatinske wie die Nabelschnur, das Kind mit der Mutter. The Western Shoshone Nation owns the Nevada nuclear test site, where the United States and Great Britain test their nuclear weapons. The Western Shoshone Nation is the most bombed nation in the world. So tell the world not to do that anymore. Stop uranium mining, testing, stop everything. So I hope we will correct this and whoever comes out We'll meet the great spirit on the other end again. But my grandfather gave me a basic philosophy that I continue to live by today. And that is, to destroy the land is to destroy the people. 
we stretch our hands to embrace the whole world together with Mother Earth. O Mother Earth, for the offenses that humanity, instead of appreciating, when the uranium mine became part of our lives, I feel that as a family, we lost a lot. The family values, culture, and tribal traditions changed. My father became employed at the mine, and we never farmed on a large-scale basis again. We need to stop this uh, uranium digging. It's no good for the world, no good for us, no good for anybody. They should just bury it and keep it buried until something until we can find out what we can do with it. But if we can't use it, just leave it alone. And I extend my hand to all the indigenous peoples here today that we all work together to rise above from this hearing. The spirit of the land, I suppose, is what we're all trying to protect. I wish us all success in this and in our struggle to stop this industry which causes so much pain to so many people in so many places. Uh, you have les îles du Pacifique sont notre mère nourricière et nous, les rejetons propres de cet arbre et de cette mère nourricière, nous sommes Ma et Ohi. But uh, what I want to indicate is that where it was not because of a miracle or God or an accident, but it was just absolutely because of the <coughs> Europe capitalist and imperialist values. Forward with the struggles against uranium. Forward. Forward. Government has been a great part of the problem. You name one government that has protected its own people, rich or poor, from uranium. Who were these people? And who made these decisions to take me, a baby, two-year-old, and, and use me in an experiment as a human guinea pig? You know, who are these neo-Nazis? I mean, these nuclear Nazis. I think that's the best description, nuclear Nazis. The nuclear cities of the world are the new Buchenwalds, the Auschwitz II's of our time. In fact, our nuclear uh, power plan, our nuclear program, was uh, developed uh, in Argentina through uh, military governments and not by civilian governments, as everywhere, from the United States to China or to Germany, every time nuclear power is linked with military people. I will continue to work with you and with anyone to preserve and protect my culture. It seems that the true ET is Edward Teller. That what we label as a crisis in our environment is equally as much a crisis within ourselves a crisis of human consciousness and values. But I'm here to tell you that now they're knocking on our door because they can't find any place to store the damn stuff for eternity. They come to our homeland and they want to lease some land for 10,000 years. My God, 
They've only been there for 500 years this year. What makes them think they're going to be here for 10,000 years? And I would propose a solution. Leave uranium in the ground and let's bury capitalism with it. Thank you. This hearing is just the beginning. We are going to spend the coming years and probably all our lives seeing that the story is told, that the conspiracy of silence and secrecy is broken. And I told him not to dig for uranium. For if they did, the children would die. They didn't listen. They didn't listen. They didn't listen to me. That's one thing about indigenous peoples you'll find all over the world. We've got a perverse sense of humor. It's what keeps us alive. <laughs>